How, how's everyone doing, TikTokers? Is all fresh and well? That means one thing and one thing only. The weekend has landed. Come on, the Rovers. Yeah, so um, welcome to the deadline stream for hashtag game week 10. We're in, we're in double, double, double figures now. Just, just to let you know, and um, don't forget, um, don't forget to log in your team at um, half six to um, tonight. Yeah, and don't forget to log in your team, and then the real Viva if you're playing playing that. Um, as 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 well, I English fantasy, the real the real Viva. Yeah, so don't forget to um, log in your team for that at um, quarter, quarter, quarter to eight as well. As well, just let you know. So um, my team is like this. So um, my team is Ariola on goal, defence, Mighty Cash, Kieran Trippier, um, Corn Cornwell. In doggy, uh, midfield Madison, Captain Salah, uh, Saka, Cole Palmer, my vice captain Watkins, and Haaland, my benches, Turner, uh, Morgan Gibbs Ray, his teammate, um, Arthur, and Lamptey on Fortuny for Lamptey, he's um. Not gonna be not gonna be available this weekend against Fulham, uh, which is which is uh, fer, uh, very dis which is very disappointing. Yeah, so I made my two transfers about. I think it was I think it was about half three twenty five to four or something like that. Yeah, so I got in um Saka a place of um. Son. And. I got in, Cole Palmer. A place of um, uh, his other Chelsea teammate who's injured as well, um, Drew Mecca. Would you believe it or not? And um, the reason why I got in, um, um, Saka, he's got good fixtures. One against Sheffield United, and he's got a good fixture in game week 12 at home against um, the Clarets Burnley. And um, Cole Palmer, the reason why I got him in, and he's very cheap. Of course, he went up to five million uh, this week. Of course, the reason why I got him in because he's um he's um he's playing out of position for Chelsea. He's a striker, and of course, he's on penalties as well. That's the reason I got him, got him in. Um, my 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 could my concerns for this um, what do you call it and um, this um, um hashtag game um game week ten is in doggy as you can see he's let off flagged at the mo at the moment like he's he's actually starting for me at the at the moment uh, yeah so um he's he's start starting for me at the moment but of course we we. Hopefully we will get the team news. Um, cause Tottenham play tonight. If if a doggy doesn't start, um, I be I be putting him on the bench and I got I got I got I got um, and I would have to um bring on Morgan Gibbs right. I'm afraid, and Morgan Gibbs right. Uh, the reason why I got Morgan Gibbs right in. The. What do you call it? Um, the wild card again we gave because um he had a good fixture against um Luton and to be fair, over the two matches he's been very unlucky. Did see how many chances he got against um oh, Luton. Um, Palace and Palace in game week seventy was very unlucky not to get something. A uh, a a course. Which which was um. 
very, very, very unlucky. Yeah, but that's that. Uh, that that's that's the way that's the way it goes sometimes. If if a doggy, as I said, it's not certain. I'm going. I'm going to have to play Morgan. Gibbs Gibbs right. Which, but we but we but we will find out anyway. And um, ju that's what that's why I got um, Cole Palmer in because I don't have that much money in the bank. I only have um zero point seven now in the bank. I was got I was gonna get um, Joe Pedro back for Brighton, but I know they got good fixtures. But um, he's um, what do you call it? Uh, not nailed. For Brighton, because um, what happens if he doesn't start on Sunday? That would that would be um. That would not be that would not be good if I'm honest with you. Which I could take, which I couldn't take uh, take that risk as well. Yeah, so I'm gonna take you to the um. Oh, what do you call it? Predictions and. I'm actually going to go through the live score predictions. Would you believe it or not? Uh, live score, 6. So the score I've gone for... The score I've gone for this weekend... And it's and 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 it's and it's free to play as well. Yeah, free to play the score, but but uh, but but not um betting, but not betting again, uh, not betting teams. Unfortunately, that's all free. Only the prediction scores. So the score I've gone for. I've gone for I've gone for three now, Arsenal. Okay, Sheffield United. One all the train, Bournemouth and Burnley. Uh, go for one nil Newcastle away Wolves. I know it's a tough one. Two 0 West Ham against Everton. Two one Liverpool, but I think I'm going to change that. I'm going to change it to three one Liverpool. And and in the Manchester derby. I am not looking for not looking forward to this. Um, British of my team, Man United nil, Man City three on Sunday. Cause we are simply not we are simply not playing well at the moment. If I'm if I'm completely honest with you. So that's um what do you call it? If you want to uh oh what do you call it? Do your password. Um, well, email password on 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 the live score, and um, su super brew, the other one, super brew that I've gone for, gone for one 0 Tottenham, two 0 Chelsea, one other Shane Bournemouth and Burnley, I've gone for four now Arsenal. Uh, one 0 Newcastle, two 0 West Ham, four 0 Aston Villa against Luton, two one Brian. I think full. I think Fulham will get a goal. To be to 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 to, to be fair. Three 0 Liverpool, but I'm actually going to change it to three one. And three and three 0 and three 0 Man City. To be fair, just going to put me head up. Uh, yeah, so the reason why um I put put three now Man City because um May and I at the moment we are not playing for we are not playing well at all. Uh, during the week against um Copenhagen, we 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 should have only gotten a draw. We did we we didn't we didn't deserve to win that match on Tuesday. We were very bad. And I felt sorry for Copenhagen. 
because they, they played really well on Tuesday. Yeah, so um, another top another topic. Um, just to let you know on the injuries, as I said, um, Lamptey is not playing. He's nearly there, but he's not going to be ready on time against Fulham because um, I actually got him in for for the good fit for the good fixture against um Fulham, which is this game weekend. He's not playing, which is which is unlucky, but. It's uh, it, it 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 is what it is, I suppose. As 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 well. And um, of course, um, the shocking news that I heard on um, fantasy um, um, uh, fantasy um, scout cast, uh, that um, the ball keeper is injured. Uh, would you believe it or not, um, Neto. Is injured for Bournemouth. Yeah, so um, he's not he he's actually not down here, boy, 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 will be. I think um, the they said um, the he had an ankle injury. Trist, yeah, ankle injury, which is a big blow to big ball to Bournemouth. But to be fair, Bournemouth. Like they're not playing badly, but they're just they're just not they're just not getting them um, the results. And of course, um, that was actually a good result for Wolves and Gary O'Neill back to his old club. Great result for Wolves. And to be fair, Borough Borough should have not gotten rid of him. But that was a that was a bit that was a big mistake. Because um he kept he kept Borough up last season. Yeah, as 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 well, which is which was a a a great achievement. Yeah, but this season is going to be a lot tougher for them. Yeah, so if the manager loses, the former manager, he's he's he could he could be nearly gone. That um uh, that could that could possibly happen. As well. So I'm gonna take you to um or oh, what do you call it the team? Team, 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 team. Oh, yes. So uh, the guy who I followed on um X that used to be that used to be Twitter, of course, um on um FPL Bellardi and UCL Bellardi on um X. Uh, yeah, so um so I'm gonna go to FPL see that's team. The deadline is close. <laughs> Closer close. Last decision taken at four and do Madison to sack it. Uh mm, Hashtag FPL company. Hashtag FPL. Hashtag game week ten. So um his team is um Ariola and Go. Defense and Doggy. Burn Cash. Uh, midfield. Um Madison. I don't I don't we could he could be getting rid of Madison. Uh Son Oh, that guy who spied me in for Brighton, who I could have gotten in as well, but he play, he played last night. I don't I don't think he'd be starting for Brighton for Brighton on Sunday. Do you want to take that risk? Um, Vice Captain Salah, um, Diaby, Haaland, and Captain Watkins. Uh, subs Turner, Silma. Arthur and Buckman for Newcastle who's injured at the moment still. F FPL guide could be Captain and Parrell. Yeah, I, I don't think I, I don't think you should go for that to be fair. Uh, 
Yeah. Oh, that guy. Oh, what do you call it? Oh, he, oh, he, he did the same thing. He got in and um, what do you call it? Palmer. You got in Watkins. Oh, he's, oh, he's captain Saka. Saka for captain. Saka for captain. FP, FPL Rudy's team. Uh, Ariola and goal. Defense, Spurn. Pa uh, Pedro Paro. Um, Trippier. Cash. Midfield. Diaby. Son. Um, Captain. Saka. Vice Captain. Salah. Um, up front, Highland uh, and Highland. Jesus, they're against each other. Uh, his bench is um, Turner, Arthur, Jumeka, who's injured, and uh, Charlie Taylor of um, Burnley. Yeah, just pe people saying all oh, about FPO. Parity and uh, and Jesus ruled out for a few weeks due to a uh, muscle injury. Yeah. Bachman not yet back, not yet, but not yet training, but back. On the grass, Elliot Anderson ruled out for two mo two months due to so that's Elliot Anderson of um, Newcastle as well. It really is. Diaz's team. You got Ed Son a place of Foden as well. Um, his team, Ariel and Go, Defence, Simicas, Trippier, uh, Mighty Cash, Midfield, Salah, Captain, S uh, Saka, Captain, Son, James R. Prowse, Nunes. Albert Julian Alvarez and Vice Captain Watkins Bench Turner. Oh, he's put Madison on the bench. Wow. Burn and Kapoor of Luton. That's his team. FPL flag. In doggy is in the hashtag Tottenham squad to face hashtag Palace tonight. Well, it depends if he starts or not. Like depends. Of course, of course. Um, if he would have stayed on for another five minutes on Monday, he would have got me a clean sheet. Yeah, so my last game week was actually a good game week. Um, I got 83 points. That, that, that's actually the second time that's happened this season. 80, 83 points. Just just what do you call it? A pity. Uh, that I didn't captain Salah. But, but to be fair, um, I think he was lucky to get the two goals, if, I, if I'm honest with you. Because um, even though Ashley Young got sent off for a second bookable, uh, the Liverpool defender should have got, gotten a, a red card as well. And Everton players like Sean Dice w w w w w wasn't, very, wasn't very happy at all. Really wasn't.
FPLT T double E uh, sorry Team Team Locked Madison A place of soccer Oh wow He's made a goalkeeper transfer Wow he got rid of the Turner place of that Brentford second choice keeper Wow Um, his team is way in goal. Defense, Trippier, Cash, Pedro Paro, uh, Saka, Vice Captain Son, uh, Salah's Captain, Jerbon, Watkins, J Julian Alvarez, Nunes, his bench, that Brentford keeper. Second choice keeper, Neto, Taylor, and Yeti, that Crystal Palace defender. Who to put on the bench? Oh, FPL as a. That's a tough one. I think I will go for Pearl. Pearl to be on the bench. Because Tottenham will 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 have a tough game. Because um Palace, even though they're missing the attack attack players, but they can they can make it very difficult for teams. I know um Tottenham won four 0 there last season, and of course that was um Matt Dirty's last goal for Tottenham. Would you believe it or not? And then um then what do you call it? Then the following season, Palace beat them 3 0 home. The following season, something, yeah, something like that, which is which is crazy, really. Updates from FPL Ronaldo. Any updates on if Udagi? Will be available for tonight fixture. FPL chases team. In goal, Ederson. Defense. Trippier. Mer Romero. Saliba. Midfield. Luis Diaz. Oh, that, that Ukrainian guy. Oh, oh, he's on, but we can't hear him. Andy. Mecca. Eh, uh, Hello. Oh, sorry, not Mecca. Me not Mecca. Hello. Of course I needed the stream. It's that kind of day today. It's that kind of day. Oh, Chelsea a bit further. The stream... Who, who, who got the second goal against um, Arsenal last weekend? It's working. It's working. Uh, it's that kind of day, honestly. Um, Matona, vice captain. I say Saka. Up front. Really up Haaland. Uh, and we'll see you later on. Uh, so. Julian know. Alvarez uh, and captain Watkins. Um, his benches, Ariola and Doggy. In Bono, in Bo, in Bono, and Ni Nico Henry, who's out for the rest of the season, of course. FPL Bengers team. Yeah, so um, is T he's play wild card draft. Yeah, might want to take me hat off. Get a bit, get a bit hot now. Just put on that robe. If Rovers get, if Rovers win, to, if Rovers win tonight, we win the league again. It four, it'd be four in a row. Hopefully tonight. As well. 
Well, because I'm, I'm between like Bowen, Matoma, Diaby, um, Palmer, Adingra, uh, Jay, Maguire. And, and, is, and is just on now. Let's talk Palmer, FPL. Palmer, Taylor. Oh, he's not re revealing his team. Of course, course, I think he's playing as wild card this week. Is Andy? FPL Professor could be captured in cash. But to be fair, I don't really want, really want to captain the defender. Maybe to later on in the season. Not now. Because the last captain defender that I made last year was, do you remember when it was in Birmingham? The last time I captained the defender was um, Cancelo. Uh, la, 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 last season, do you remember that? And he got a straight red card against Bullham. Yeah. So I quite like Adingra. I'm still not sure I'm going to go for him over Palmer. But also I'm not sure... Bedingra, who's also 5 million. For Brighton. That's why I didn't get him in, because it could be a rotation. FPL flag in Doggy is set to start for hashtag Spurs tonight. But, but we... But, I'll put a like but we'll see what happens of course yeah to be fair to be fair Crystal Palace they're, they're hard to be at home to be fair well to be fair because to be fair they got a very good goalkeeper this year in um, Sam Johnson I actually ha I actually have him in the wild card in the other one uh, the real Viva one but but won't be starting. I might be starting uh, Mariola this week. Like the fancy Premier League. Gordon or Neto. FPL O T D doesn't matter with Watkins guys I'll transfer him in his run is offered over let's the row season continues Continue. Oh, I mean, who? I just Jao Pedro against Fulham instead of like if Jao Pedro starts today. Oh, sorry. On Sunday. He's better than Palmer, right? That'd be weird. And then he's got Sheffield United at home in game week twelve. Will he definitely start that one? Who knows? Who knows? I guess I can't. Keep, I can't get out of my head that. Um, yeah. Not going to start every game, no, he's not. That's why I didn't. That's why I didn't get back in. To be fair, he's actually doing pretty well in the Europa League this year. I think he's got about what? What is it? Four goals in three matches for Brighton in the Europa League this season. But of course, three of them were from um, um penalties, of course. And of course, um. And of course, it, it was Brighton's first win in in Europa League last night in Europe. Uh, fair, fair, fair play to the um, to the Seagulls. Yeah, because um, I don't know what's happened to that team from the Netherlands this year. Ajax. I don't. I don't know what's happened to them. I've never seen Ajax. Since I became a United fan, do this bad. Probably ever, because, um, what do you call it? Ajax got a great um, 
Um, Academy. But I don't, I don't, I don't know, I don't know what's happened to them this year. Yeah, like in the Dutch Adam Bear division, uh, they're second bottom in the league, and uh, and it's a totally new Ajax team this year. Yeah, so. EPL, JD's team. He got rid of um, Mbano. I'm not going to. He could be taking a four point here. Oh uh, yeah. Keeps his place in the team. Four point nine million is pretty good, right? Well, it's five million now. It's five million now, Andy. I feel you're right. Ferguson will start, and I think it'll be Jao Pedro number ten. Yeah, Jao Pedro could be starting. But like, there is some risk. There is some risk for sure. But to be fair, Brian. They got great Scott, but they have so many injuries as well. Yeah, which which is a pity, which is a pity. Like probably I would get probably I would get in game week twelve. I might get Esther Pena back. Who knows? If he's ready, of course. If he if he's ready. In terms of Spurs news, I've not seen anything, but obviously we'll talk about it if I, if I, see, uh, see, it if I see it from anyone legit. If I see it from legit. I'm really not even sure about whether Dougie will start. I wish I, wish I had some kind of injury yeah. before I did. Uh, I hope Dougie's doing Of course, I want to wish Ireland, Ireland women the best luck today. For you. I'm not going to watch the match on TV because I'm live. Doing this, I'm watching YouTube as well. Like, yeah, like he's saying about MJ or Prowse, his numbers is pretty good, but um, what do you call it? The only pro the only problem that I say, he's um, he's pl he's playing M3 deep now. It's War Prowse. Like um he's only just one one more go go away. If he if he scores a free kick he would be um David Beckham's record. On free kicks. On goals. On free kicks. Yeah, which is which is crazy, isn't it? As well as well. No, no, no chance. And doggy to Simicas. Yeah. Saka captain over Salah or Harlem in my team. Uh, thanks very much for being a member for 18 months, Alex. Uh, I would say Salah over Saka, but Saka's very good. Jamie Kate Wildcard, Madison out for Martinelli, I have gone. I probably just keep Or even I could have got, even could have gotten Douglas Luiz of um, Aston Villa. But that would have let me, what do you call it? 0.2. And of course, he's already on four little cards. What happens if he gets a little card? This weekend, he will miss against um, Nottingham Forest in game in um, game week eleven. If he picks up a shit little card. FPL cyclist Jacob. Yeah, 
He's got in Saka place of Fernandez. Um, um, Salah, captain. His team is Pickford and Goal. Defense. Cornwell. Cash. Simakas. Midfield. Saka. Captain um, Salah. Latona. Jerbone. Strikers. Oli Watkins, vice captain. Solanke. And Haaland. Spenches. Turner and Dougie. Esther Pena and Elliot Anderson. Who are both injured. And of course, and Dougie's never flagged. At the, at, the, at, the, at the moment. I don't. Yeah, but are so too many. That's a problem. Yeah. Thomas Party is injured as well. Yeah. Ketia started seven times this season. Things, team. Um, and go. Ariola, Depends. Trippier. Pedro Paro. Cash. Sara. Captain Saka. Douglas Ruiz. Son. Uh, for up front. Damian. Julian Alvarez and vice captain Watkins, Spenches, Leno, War Prowse, Anderson of Palace, and Max Ahrens of Bournemouth. Yeah. Of course. Yeah, what do you call it? The reason why I've gone for Salah's captain because um, he didn't play that many minutes last night in the Europa League. And then um, Ollie Watkins, I don't I don't think he would score big, maybe about I'm gonna say Ollie Watkins might only get probably about nine nine or ten points. Can it be? Something like that. Because he, he played um, 87 minutes last night for Villa in the Europa Conference League. Last night. Oh, he got the wrong player. Oh, Jesus. FPL rate rating for the Tottenham lineup. Risk before. I'm trying to pick that word. I don't know that word. I've never seen that word before. Uh, it's, it's been opposed to move to Tottenham. Uh, it's been opposed to move to Tottenham. Status or something? I have a, I, no, I haven't got a clue. S-A-L-E-C-H-S-T. That's the one. Uh, Tottenham Hotspur. Tottenham Hotspur. Tottenham Hotspur. Establishing. Something like that. Madison to make... It 
I would rather have even more yeah, I think I would rather have painful. I will say though, Cash, I do think the next three fixtures are the kind where Cash could just go mad, right? They're three pretty good fixtures, they're decent enough for clean sheets, he can be really attacking. That would be my only worry. I do think though, if Cash doesn't go crazy in this first game, then that 0.5 saving will probably be much better in the long run. But I think for me, like, I, I think it's really about it. Cash to Estopini in game week 13 does look pretty good. So, I guess we'll see how much of a uh, He doesn't know, for this, this third guy, Alex, he doesn't know about his doggy late fitness test, apparently. Ooh, so we might not find out He's having a late fitness a test. Is a doggy. A late fitness test. I mean, not really. Like, you go with, you go with him the way you prefer. I've got Son. The one thing I'll say is, is... If all the defenders FPL match team. Play, there is some really nice value. Simicas, Gabriel, Cash, Howard. Ariola and Goal. Spence. Potential to get clean sheets. In which case, that's why. Cash. But it could end up that Trippier carries. Gabriel and Doggy. There's a risk either way. Midfield. Diaby. I mean, I'm not sitting on the fence, but I've gone with Son. I've sold Trippier. Madison. Vice captain Son. Tyler. Up front, Haaland, Solanke and Watkins as captain. Bench, Turner, Byrne, Charlie Taylor and Jumeka, who's injured. FPL family Lee's team. Ariel on goal. Cash. Pedro Paro. Gabriel. Let me see here. Salah. No, oh, sorry, uh, midfield. Saka. DRB. Madison. Captain Salah okay, and Bono, right, Vice Who Captain Haaland and Watkins, Solz, Turner, Byrne, Cameron Archer and Capu of Luton. What? Oh Jesus, he's checking on Mark Sullins' team, I think. How much money has he got? Jesus. If, if, oh, hang on. Not in Katia. Not in Katia. Yeah, I'm one million off that team. I'm one million off. Oh, and his one man is off that team. Fair enough. I hold my hands up. There is someone that's got Watkins, Harlan, Saka, Salah, Son, and Trippier. What a ridiculous wild card. What a ridiculous wild card. He's, he, and he said he's won me an after. He has got Saka. Obama. Oh, he can't show properly.
<laughs> I'll just say you're all Karen Tame. That is disgusting. I believe that, man. Yeah, neither can I. Mocking a, mocking a beast at this season. Yeah, he actually is. He's he's beat me, but not as many. Not as many points. I have to check how many points has he beat me. How many points is he ahead? He's only two points ahead of me. He's only two points ahead of me. Two points ahead of me. At the moment. <laughs> what a ridiculous team. Um, sorry, wh where were we? Just just 59 minutes ago to the deadline closes, by the way. So don't forget to log in your teams. Right now. Average is a sacrifice then. 352 playing Palmer over these Ravners. And it's most people on wildcard are playing Palmer. Or, or rotating with a defender. Like most people have to do what Mark is doing. Apart from they don't have Trippier, they have um, Gay. <laughs> Mark the Gay? Mark basically has Gay instead of. Not, sorry, Mark has Trippier instead of Gay, essentially. Wow. I mean, yeah, okay, he's got Obama and Shikoja, but I think that's. Um... Obama? Andy said that was. That's mental. Uh, no Harlan squad, bench boost game week 12, get Harlan game week 15, nice, good luck. Nice, good luck. Four prowls to Saka Bowen. Uh, I think this latter two definitely a better combination, yeah. I hope you both play three league two, thank you very much. Start Bird or Neto? Uh, pro probably Neto, I hope. Probably Neto. Who does Wolves have? Oh, they got Newcastle at home. Right now, team value not matter. Team value not matter. Lots of early moves and it's paid off. Do do do. Omar card, Darwin or Son, Son, Ray or Ariola, Ariola, Gabriel. Have to check in Germany. Because of the next hour after this stream is over, have to do the German fancy. Then, then of course do the do the Rovers team news on TikTok as well. Now to do what you call it as well. The English fantasy. Oh, sorry, Italian fantasy. Well, playing my wild card on that. And the Spanish fantasy. I'm also playing up my wild card on that as well. Now to do um English fantasy. Well, play, I'm also playing the wild card on that as well. So I said, and I and I had to do um Portugal as well. Yeah, so I'll check in Germany. Uh, I think it's Saliba and Diaby. Uh, I don't know, I'd probably go Trippier and uh, Palmer in that case, actually. It's a genuine question, though. I mean, I'm trying to pick the players that I think are the best. I don't give a fuck, man, I was going to swear. Like, I don't care if they're boring or not. I, I really don't. I just pick the players that I think are going to score the most points, and that is it. And if that means picking all the template players, that is what I'll do. That is what I do. Member for 66 months. Wow. Stephen Gallagher in the comments. He's been a member for 66 months. Charge it now. To charge me phone now. Uh, Pepperson, thank you very much. Rami, bring Maguire to a defender or keep Taylor and keep 0 0.3 in the bank. I, I think it really depends on what you, you think. Maguire yeah, so in Germany, I'm going to get rid of that man who's been, who's been a top goal scorer for Stuttgart. It's the first time that he's not playing this weekend. I really don't. He's injured. So probably for most people, bank 0.3 million. But I think, I think Maguire at 4.2 could be quite a decent fit. Yeah, Maguire... What do you call it? It's only 4.2. <laughs> that is mad. That is crazy. I mean, Chelsea 
I'm sorry. Germany. Three versus two. One wrong transfer in place for Lanky. Who is Lanky even got this week? Uh, Bernie at home. Oh, Bernie at home. Can't be getting rid of Solanke this week, surely. Surely. Next week, Solanke can go Pedro and Madison snap at the two. But he goes into Gabriel. Uh, I don't know if there's going to be any. So who will I get in? Pedro this week. So probably we go with Gabriel. Especially if you can still then do. Madison Saka. You don't need to do Madison Saka next week. Uh, two free transfers. Is Doggy for Simicast slash Gabriel and Madison for Bowen? Uh, I probably wouldn't use a free transfer on Madison for Bowen. I'd just do the first one on a roll. Gordon or a dingle. Just do the first one on a roll. Gordon is the better pick. Well, roll, 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 roll your boat gently down the street. Uh, Marnie, 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 Marnie. My first brother scream. Wow. Uh, Son and Alan were on for Saka and Matoma. What do you think? Uh, I think the second combination is better, yeah. Although, Almiron's surely pretty nailed now, right? Because um, Murphy's out. Yeah, Almiron's pretty... Because... Wildcard... Te- oh, my days. Wildcard 10, defender 4. <laughs> oh, my days. Play 4 4 2 in games 10, 12, 14, and bench Neto. Play Neto in games 11. God, it's a tough one this week in Germany. I can kind of visualize all of that, but to me, it sounds like you've got a plan. That's all you can have. You've got good players. You're set. Get it locked in. Uh, Latest on Lampy is the same as Estepini, and uh, Deserbi is hopeful that he'll be back soon, basically. If Madison Matoma go big, definitely watch him slap off. Or do they take him out? FP a black box. Uh, there's no info on a doggy. I'm not convinced you're gonna get any either, but um, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, both teams are against each other. Hang on for eleven. They're struggling. Well, I mean, depends. How many changes will you make this week, and how much different will the wild card look next week? You have to weigh that up. My general advice would be, if you're still deciding whether to wildcard and you haven't really thought about what your wildcard team will be, there's 51 minutes to go. I would probably just leave it. <laughs> probably just leave it. I'm kind of already sure what to do. I don't think there's any issue with wildcarding this late for what it's worth. If you know what team you're going to go for. I've wildcarded late plenty of times. Um, so yeah, just keep that in mind. Diaby and Maguire or Gordon and Gay on wildcard. Probably Gordon and Gay, I guess, is a bit safer. It's a tough one this week. I don't know, just part of me that thinks Maguire started the last three games, right? One in the Champions League, two in the league. Ten Hag was talking him up. 4.2 million. Is that too good to turn down? Is it? Is that too good I, I Too good to turn down? Playing against, um, really? When Lampy's back, Estrepini will be back, and then Lampy's minutes will be robbers. But I mean, Brands Way has not got many good fixtures either, so they're both pretty bad. Really, you want Taylor, which, which tells me you're going with Taylor and Brands Way, so I'm not sure what team you're going for. You're going for the same team for both. Okay. If you've got Evan Ferg, bench Lascelles or Evan Ferguson? I mean, Evan Ferguson. Bench Lascelles or Evan Ferguson? Benchless Ellis. Rank them. Matoma, Richarlison, Diaby, Jao Pedro. I would say... I, I'm, I'm still quite torn between Diaby and Matoma, I've got to be honest. But I'll say Matoma, then Diaby, then Jao Pedro. Demi, Ketia, then Richarlison. Thoughts on the Robbie Fowler captain? I'm not sure what he's going to captain from, to be honest with you. Oh, Jesus. Uh, Callum, how's it going? Wildcard, Ariola, Trippier, Simicas, Gay, Diaby, Almiron. Isn't that one quite expensive? Salah, Madison, Watkins, Jao Pedro, Harlan, Bench, Turner, Neto, Taylor, Brantway. I mean, it sounds good. Obviously, cheap is full. Yeah, Bench is quite cheap. Bench is quite cheap. Um, isn't that one like over six? It's 
point four for an ally. I can't get on board with that. I think the time is a very similar price. Surely you're going to return that over an ally. You can get Maguire instead if I go Archer down to Nubana. So, Brand's waiting Archer or Maguire and Nubana. I think the form is probably better, the one without Maguire. How different do you see gaming 12 wildcard, for example? I'm going to be honest, I've not looked at gaming 10, 12 wildcard at all. It's not even that like I've not looked at it a little bit, I've not looked at it at all. Uh, so He's I'm not looked at it at, at all. Like someone, someone said earlier, someone said to me earlier, not to me directly, but I just it was in the chat, and they said, how are you going to handle blank gaming 29? I was thinking, I, I, I don't even know what I'm doing in gaming 12 with two, three transfers, let alone gaming 29. Back. Like, I'm all for planning, right? I'm all for planning. I don't know. Did a wing it for I don't know. Ben Cunning tells me to do, basically. Uh, Diaby... Yeah, I'll be Maguire. Oh, yeah, sorry, just forgot. Uh, Wayne's going to get wild card, yeah. Sonic Cast 442 or Matoma Diaby 352, no third. I mean, Sonic Cast is pretty good next few weeks, isn't it? Sonic Cast is good in a few weeks. Can you rank captaincy in order? Salah, Saka, Watkins, Harlan, Son. Zinchenko, Madison to Maguire, Saka, or Madison, Alvarez to Matoma, Watkins. I, I don't... Probably Matoma Watkins, I guess. Probably Matoma Watkins, I guess. I'm actually gonna get. I'm, I'm actually gonna get Undab. I haven't even like. I haven't even got my wild card locked in or anything. I'm still thinking about that. Like, Six million. It's a good price. Who who yours play for Brighton? Considering a minus four, happy with midfield, but Hoyland and Watkins up front, Casper and Cher back three, lots and lots of money in the bank. Uh, I don't know what the minus four is, and obviously Hoyland's not great this week, but Casper and Cher are always fine, so he might not need a minus four. Have a nice thing, uh, Fon, thank you very much, have a nice. I've got Ariel as much as Watkins. I mean, yeah, if you're happy Seven Harland, that's not too bad. Especially if you're happy Seven Harland? Yeah. Oh yeah, so I'll go to check on other streams. Who's live? On other streams. To be fair. Oh, what you got a fancy scout cast? On their teams. To achieve the title of Engineer's Art and Fellow. Achieving this award continues to motivate and inspire me to promote an engineer and culture. Yes, as well. Much respect, man. It's also your first ever one. Uh, it's according to YouTube, so once again, we will celebrate that. Oh, Jesus. Da David and Seb. Yeah, They're very close on rank. So I'm wondering. David know, Monday's. Um, Dylan, if you have one point two K and then like that, one zero six K pretty close between them. Five one six five eight is a minus four hit worth it to swap Madison and get Watkins in for Luton. And yeah, what's up basically the super chat? So there you go. A minus four to get Madison sorry, to get Watkins for Madison. Obviously half this question I guess is missing. So who are the other players involved in that? So I've just said that the models are excited about having Triple Villa. Triple Villa. Oh, the models touches in the penalty area. Jesus, Salah's had 37. Touches in the penalty area. 37 touches. I don't think you want Triple Spurs anymore, for example, like I have on wild card. But in that... Mara's 24 for a little. The penalty area. Madison, I feel like he's Watkins, I think that's 30 or 36. I think it's 30. Getting rid of Son, less the penalty Son's area. Price. Son's price, he's almost the victim of his price uh, in many ways because he is going to have opportunities 
Uh, what is going to have instances in the coming weeks where you're not going to catch him again, where you might catch him with Saka or you might catch him with Salah. Or yeah. Or so using him as a make to be to be fair, Son's record against pa Crystal Palace, it's not great away. To be honest with you, says that and goals, it's not great. To 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 be fair. Uh, and of course, they were saying uh, what do you call it yesterday or the other day. Um, Chelsea have never beaten Brentford. That is very true. They've never been in Brentford in the Premier League, but I think that could change. That could change this weekend. I think Chelsea are starting to come into. They're starting to come into a bit of form. Yeah, because what it what it called it. Last Saturday, they should have beaten Arsenal. If it wasn't for the Chelsea's goal, goalkeepers and clearance. Which, to be fair, was a great goal by by Declan Rice. Gets his old club because he used to be with, Ch with Chelsea when he was a kid. In the um, the academy. Um, but you don't. But you don't want. You, when the keeper has the ball, you don't want to clear it to the opposition player. And that's and that's what he did. That was when Arsenal got back into the game at two one. Numbers and tables. Watkins. Had this discussion. The fact that he plays for Aston Villa and Cote point three, you've got the guy that's had more shots in the box than any other player in the last four, more sh uh, the joint most shots on target than any other player. Joint joint most shots and on target by any so player. He outranks Salah for the loads thing. Salah has a harder fixture. He um, does. Yeah, that's kind of like the debate there. But if, but but Ferris will concede goals. Like, how did they concede two goals against Reckon Lilton Town? Uh, they let that one slip last Saturday. The Forest. They seem, to, they seem to be better away from home, if I'm honest with you. Because they don't concede that many goals away. Forest. I don't know what, I don't know why that is like. To, 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 to be honest with you. Churchy touches in the penalty area by Watkins. Big chances, I mean, probably I have time to go for this one, so, so I won't. I think they can be valuable, but they are quite subjective, and they are a little bit arbitrary sometimes. I think XG, for example, is a better measure, and gives you a more qualitative take. Shots in the box is a similar thing, right? It's just quantity. Shots in the box? How many shots in the box? Oh, Jesus. Salah's got 13. Shots in, in the box. Walking 15. Oh, shots in the box. 
in the box. So it's close. So it's close between them, like. Slightly astray. It's combining. So especially in small samples, over large samples, and when we're saying large samples, I mean like a season or two. Season or two. Here, something like XG generally wins out, especially if you understand who the player is. So like a Harry Kane. Harry Kane. Just overperform XG, whereas in a more pain, they underperform. So I can add that as context. In a smaller sample, where things like XG, you know, one match XG is useless. I I will only ever use it to go. Did they create good chances? Did the score reflect that? Did they create good chances? Very tough. If you can start combining things, XG per shot. That was the only chance that they had in three matches. Versus, say, a player who was just putting up consistent 0.1 XG. Consistent 0.1. Match. And so, yeah, maybe falling off in terms of total numbers. But maybe total, no total numbers as well. Now, How do they use those things? Oh, God, my legs are killing me. Yeah. Oh, God. Oh, God. Unfortunately, FBL, you know, by the time we get enough data, it's not relevant anymore. True. It's alright, but again, it could be out of date. So we're confident. Game could be out of date. Some people are after. That then becomes another thing that's like you're effectively asking your team to take four points away. Um, four points away? So, like, it's, it's the certainty. Like, I, I won't phrase this very well, I'm so sorry. Someone smarter than me would, would be able to put this better. But if you take a minus four, you have definitely 100% lost four points. That, there's no if you take a minus four, you have lost four points. Someone to return more than four points to pay you back. And yeah, so I'm going to go back to Andy. Orly. Yeah, so if you were to take a four point hit, if you want to get Watkins, if you're stuck for if you're stuck for your finance team, like as as well. Its water based formula actually fights odors on every fabric. Every fabric. The Breeze Fabric Refresher. La 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 la. Oh, we don't want Jurassic Park. Of course. See, can we get team nails? Go back to Andy. See, can we get team nails? No. United will not get top four this season. No chance. We are so bad. I'm afraid we are so bad this year. Keep th keep those likes coming through now on the end of the stream. Until until um until the deadline closes. Of course. We can check who's got good fixtures coming up. Actually gonna check I'm actually gonna check the score. Just the score. Melody Man, member for Mark Warmark, thank you very much. Which combination do you prefer? Pow, Diaby in the final versus Cash Bowen, Palmer, Dingler? I honestly think Pow, Diaby in the final is the slightly better. Wow. 
I just don't think I... They're drawing one out the moment or the women's. One out the moment. The first in the first nine minutes. Pau Torres instead of Cash. Gonna go to YouTube. On my phone. I can have gay if I also have. Yeah, I mean, I can do the same. I can have gay if I also have Pau Torres with the RB in the What? Yeah. Like um, What's the story on the doggy? Uh, Zomat, thank you very much for eight months. Uh, no, not really. I think the picture's getting a little bit worse. I don't trust that he can play multiple games in a row, including Champions League. Plus, we don't know how long he's that's going to be out for. He, uh, he was just saying as well, we don't know how long um, the Newcastle striker's going to be out for, um, Isak, as, as, as well. I think potentially that could be much better. The, the that could be much better. I think you need to get three games out of Nketi. You need that Burnley game as well. If you only get Sheffield United and Newcastle away and then you're forced into a transfer, I, I don't know how great that is, really. That'd be my only worry. That would be my only worry. As well. Uh, you can't decide who to captain. I mean, yeah, I mean, it's hard for me. I, I've really not thought that much. I mean, I guess when you're a wild card, a lot of your thoughts. When you're on wild card? On that, but I don't know. Sandwich has been my, my choice the whole time. <laughs> Sandwich has been his choice for the whole time. His free hit of viable options for early wild carders. He's had good games. Early wild carders. I'm actually going to check who's got good fixtures. Uh, so Liverpool got um, Nottingham Forest at home. This weekend on Salas fixtures. Um, looting away next weekend. Never, you could be another captain option again, or or you could pick um, Hala next weekend. Because um, Luton's pitch is um, it's not big, it's um, very small. Very small pitch. Then he's, then he's got Brentford. In game week 12, then he's away to Man City in game week 13. He's got fun at home in game week 14. Where's Sheffield United in game week 15? And he's got Palace, uh, Palace away in game week 16. That's Salah for Liverpool's fixtures. Haaland. Man United away on Sunday. I think he will score maybe one goal. I don't. I don't think he'd get a hat trick. If he was playing at home, he would have a chance of getting a hat trick. Uh, Bournemouth for home. Best captain option. He only got assists in the game last season at home. Uh, away to Chelsea game week 12 home to Liverpool in game week 13 home to Tottenham in game week 14 away to Aston Villa game week 15 that'd be a tough one and away to Luton in 
Game week 16. Of course, as you know, Man City blanking them. Um, game week 18 because, because, of course, as you know, last season they won the Champions League. So they're going to the World Club Championships. Uh, of course. As, as, as well. Like, um, the team that are top of the league, Tottenham, but um, to be fair, they got... Um, Tough fixture starting tonight away at Palace. That 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 won't be an easy game. That that be a tough one. Tonight. As well. I think it's close. Son and Gordon, I think. Looks pretty good. Sell and Diaby for a minus four. Yeah, and who else's pictures are pretty good? Aston Villa's pictures are pretty good. Uh, Luton at home. Home banker, to be fair. Uh, away to Donny Farris. That could be a pretty, that could be a tough one. Um, home to Fulham. Another good fixture. And then um, they're right to Tottenham. In game week 13, that's a tough one. Away to Bournemouth in game week 14. Home to Man City in game week 15. And they're home to Arsenal in game week 16. So they got two tough fixtures at home. Man City at home in game week 15. And Arsenal at home in game week 16 as well. But, but to be fair, Arsenal are pretty good at home. Away, they're not too bad. But they're, they're, they're better at home. To be fair, if you're watching, I'll just type back and say, You did say sorry to interrupt your stream. <laughs> it might not be. Say no, if, if you're not, wa not watching. But he's not set it up. Great question. Great question. He doesn't know why. He's absolutely nailed for 90 minutes. He's going back to not having Bowen. Nah. He doesn't know what he's doing, does Andy? Try six minutes to the de to the deadline closes, everybody. So don't forget to log in your teams right now. Could make a last minute decision on a doggy. In doggy. Just on my wild card, except for the change, didn't select to use my wild card. You just need to make one transfer and then just use your wild card then. You just need to make your transfer and just use your wild card then. His underlying stats are pretty good this year, so far. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, God. 
he doesn't know what he's doing anymore, does Andy? I mean, if you want me to put it in order, I'd say Bowen, then Matoma, then Diaby, but... Don't know what he's doing. Um, who's, who's in the top three? Oh, yeah, sorry. Bench one of Hoyland, Gordon, Neto are out. Probably Hoyland, yes, mate. Hoyland, definitely bench Hoyland. Diaz, Socek out. Salah, Saka, Archer in. Could work out, yeah. Could work out, yeah. Board check, Harman out. Could work. Captain Salah. Yeah. Darwin. Yeah, I'll complete the squad at this point. It's genuinely it's just no, no Darwin happening. No, yeah, he actually started last night as well, did Darren? You never know. He might, he might not start against um, Faris. Yeah, I think Sa I think Salo probably would score big. Cause I think Watkins, he might only get one more turn. Because um, what do you call it? Watkins played 87 minutes last night and Salah didn't get that many minutes. So Sa so Salah would would be fresher than Watkins. Because of course Hasselbill are coming back from um, what was it? Um, the Netherlands. Coming back from the Netherlands. Excuse me. Should I start in Ketia over Neto? If you've got in Ketia, I would say you've got What the hell home, is the story with Ndoggy? Why have you got him if you're not going to play him against What the hell is the story? Should I? Oh, yeah, sorry. Madison, Melrose, or Matoma, and Watkins, and Toma, and Watkins, I think. Son, Matoma, Archer, or Madison, Bowen, Jab, Hedro. Son, Matoma, I think. Would you do Madison to Marseille if you can't afford Saka? I'd probably just keep Madison. Uh, want to bring in Saka, two free transfers. Only options are Saka and Matoma for Son and Neto. Mm, or Gabriel and Saka into Trippier and Diaby. I, I like the second one. Invest as little as one euro in the world's, world's world. leading companies. Yeah. Start now with trading two on two oh, at zero commission. Bruno, Salad, you think you'll go home? Oh, three times. Home doesn't mean the same for me as it does for you. Why don't you come home? Uh, can I lock my four players in? Uh, I can, yeah. Only and here she is uh, Which two would you start for Madison, Parrot, Alvarez and Trippier? And you one defender to start me. Which two would you start from Madison, Parrot, Alvarez and Trippier? Well, oh, it's Trippier, obviously. Uh, Alvarez and Madison, I guess. I think, you've got, I think you can slot Trippier in, right? So just for defending. In most fixtures, but set them as well. Premier League side saying Neto out of injury. Hunter, yeah, he is. So that's, Bor uh, that's Bournemouth's Neto, not Wolves' Neto. So do not panic too much. Really up, Salenberg, really close. Don't see any, any other early team you have. Alright, let's do that. Yeah, so on, on FPL Focal. I imagine most will be both. Have you sold Harland? What was it again? And also, by the way, I've sold Trippier. I've sold Trippier. So oh, that's transferred in. Transferred out. Well, 355,000. Wow. That's your opinion the most transferred out this week? Yeah, it was like wow. Now it's 84. So I guess a million have sold him over the last. Me have, have sold him? What did Windows say? Yeah, I'm going to People are asking the questions, will and Donkey start? John says, hi Oscar, world number one's got no Haaland. Fair play. I mean, that makes sense. That was something I said back in game week. Was it game week eight? I said, I wouldn't be surprised if... Whoever wins FPL this season votes no Haaland. Uh, yeah, if who wins FPL this season, who has uh, no Haaland? Wow. Yeah, so if I, had, if I, had, if I 158 points in the last game. The guy who's world number one at the moment. If I hadn't sold Trippier, I could have afforded Ariola and Chikosa, Gabriel, Pal Torres, Taylor, Trippier, Simicas. So I'd have Trippier instead of Gabe. 
Wimbert 16 to the world. That guy, that guy who wait, who wasted his transfers at the start of the season, M. Nate and Bacon. Yeah, but guess where he is? Guess where he is? Where he is in the world in the fancy Champions League? He's 15 in the world. In the in the in the fancy Champions League. At the, would you believe it or not? There could be a game in the next few weeks that Palmer doesn't start. So really it depends on your risk. I might have to get I might I might have to I might have to sub a doggy. We haven't heard any team nails. Let's go back to where we are. Is it game week ten there? So they've got Fulham Everton, Sheffield United, Forest. <clears throat> That's like a good run of fixtures, whereas Chelsea have got Brentford, Tottenham, City, Newcastle. So if it's someone that you're gonna have to no, oh, man. No, I've messed up. Oh, he's messed up. Yeah, I, I wish I hadn't realised that now. Has Andy? What is the story with yeah. Doggy? I, I need, uh, what is the story? Are you going to get team nails? I think that's correct, yeah, because I had 6.7 million, Wow. No, no, it's not a mistake. Because I sold Trippier for 6.7, now he's 7. So a man's paid 0.3 more. Yeah. And it's 3 off. So that is. Oh, correct. I got rid of Trippier. Does that need. What the hot? What the hell is the story with him, doggy? Oops. I can still afford it now. No, I can't. No, you can't afford it. No. This is going to bug me. I've probably got 17 minutes of rocking my actual archive. Now I'm worried about what I could have done. Yeah. 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 That's pretty bad. That's pretty bad. You said that's pretty I bad, is it. Andy? No, I bought Trippier at 6.5. Yeah, I should have gotten Saka last night for 8.5. He, he actually went up on price last night, would you believe it or not? 8.6 mil again. Then I said, what, like, what, what the hell? He doesn't, he doesn't deserve to be 8.6 million. Because what, what, what was it, a few weeks back? A few, a few days ago, a week ago, he was back to 8.5. Now he's 8.6 again. Which is which is which is crazy. Like he only like he only got what what was it, an assist against Chelsea last week. Doesn't serve to be eight point six million. If I'm honest with you. But but people bought him in. I don't know, would I have done it? I don't know. Maybe not. But I think the fact that I just missed completely that I could afford it is a mistake. I think it's because I have What the hell is the story in with a doggy? I don't know. Um, anyway. I'm, I'm lost where I am now with the questions, by the way. Um, I think I got quite close to the bottom, actually. Diaby or Alvarez? Diaby this week. Diaby. Uh, without Saka like me. Quite a few people, yeah. Luis Diaz, Madison to Saka Diaby. Uh, yeah, yeah to be fair, I would have gotten in Diaby, but I couldn't, I couldn't afford it. Which is a pity, like. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> Maguire instead of Palatari. I would have gotten him drunk as the ways of it, but. But he's already on four little cards. As I said, like. No, I don't, I don't think I can do that. Gabriel. Where the. What the hell? Yeah, I have to check on X. 
I mean, I think just Kokoja, Mubama, Gabriel, and, Ta- and Maguire and Taylor is asking for a lot of trouble. There's rumors he's starting. And do, there's rumors in Doggy is starting. Rumors. What? No way. There's rumors that uh, Brandon Johnson could be starting for Tottenham as well. Rumors. What? Do, do, do. Oh, and catch you. The site is crashing. I hope not. Oh, gee. Oh, don't tell me the fucking site is crashing again. Like last season. Oh, please don't, don't, don't do this again. Uh, yeah, the last time the site crashed was game week 16 last season. Don't tell me. Short term. I feel like with Nketiah, like if, if Gabriel Jesus is back before the Burnley game, like if Gabriel Jesus is back in 15 days, it's going to be annoying that Nketiah misses Burnley at home. Always yeah, chasing at fantasy. Doggy odds that he plays today. There are the, the odds. I'm checking on X, of course. On the bench will work out better in the long run. But, uh, yeah. Is Trippier Irish? Uh, don't think so. No. English? A lot of games for England. Uh, Pedro Beta on pens. Always go with the guy with pens, right? I mean, 12 minutes to the deadline closes. Either, so it's over. Get to lock in your teams. Right now. Because you don't want to, you don't want to miss the deadline. Do 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 do. Diaby's definitely starting, right? Diaby is definitely starting. He's definitely starting. Is the timer definitely starting? Because the next three, they're both pretty good. Next three, they're both pretty good. Diaby with strong bench or bad weak bench. They'll probably go slightly. FPL fires to him. I know I've got 10 minutes. He actually got rid of a doggy for Gabriel. Uh, the start, starting lineup for uh, Ariola and Goal. Defense, Cash, Trippier, Gabriel, Midfield, Madison, Son, Bone, Captain Salah, Vice Captain Rockets, Julian Alvarez, Nunes, Bench, Turner, Neto, Anderson, and T- Charlie Taylor of Burnley at this team. Right now, I've got 
Cal Pedro in my team. I'm on 3-4-3. Three, three. He doesn't start. I mean, to be fair, like, I know he played in Europe. He's only, play, he only played 64 minutes against Man City, 45 minutes. Is that true? I guess that's like a bad thing for why he's not always going to play. How long is Gabriel Jesus out for? That. That's what we need to know. I don't think a huge amount was said about him, though. Maybe just that he's out for a few weeks, right? So what's a few weeks? So he's less than 10 minutes. I know, I know, I know, I know. I know. Don't play any more Super Chats right now, honestly. Um, or is it real, Mars? Uh, Paris Lewis leaves. Paris Lewis leaves. Spurs. Levy's worse than Pep. They've got so many. They've uh, got so many. They've got so many. What's the injury? Actually, what? Are, these are the things like I just feel like. Nine minutes to the deadline closes, everybody. Oh, no, they've got the week off after this. Oh, there's no Europa League. That's interesting. Got a whole week off before that Ajax game. They've only got one Europa League game between the next three matches. No Europa League. No Europa League. No Europa League. Why was I checking that? <laughs> I can't even remember. Uh, Evan, the thing is, Evan Ferguson then will probably be fit to start against Everton, which means then will João Pedro be saved for Ajax? Yeah, Joe Pedro could be safe for Ajax. That's what I said. He's not. He's not nailed for Brighton. Joe Pedro. Like Evan Ferguson will probably get play now and then next week, right? Yeah. Which means Joe Pedro is vying for that number ten spot, and Ansu Fati can play as well. That's right. Yeah, Ansu Fati. No, I'm gonna hate myself for putting Joe Pedro in. I just know. He's going to hate he's himself. He's this week. I'm then worrying he's going to get benched against Everton as well. And then all of a sudden, I'm just like, every other game he's won, I had a person that had it in. Matona's in. I'm talking about going with João Pedro as well. Matona's in. He, 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 he's come off the bus. Has a doggy. Don't think we're not going to get team nails. Yeah, that's a big blow for Arsenal that Jesus was out because he had a brilliant game against M. Seville during the week, the Champions League for Arsenal. But unfortunately, he's got another injury, hamstring. This time. Yeah. So keep those likes coming train now at the end of the stream. The deadline stream, I would really appreciate it. Did I take a picture of it? 1.4 million to spend. I could just leave it. I could just leave it at that. I could just, I could just bank 1.4 million. Well, I could upgrade Palmer to anyone that's 6.3 or He could upgrade Palmer? I could get Douglas Louise. No, I'm not going to Douglas Louise. Yeah. I, I, might, I, I might have to start in Doggy. Yeah. Six minutes to go to the deadline closes. Oh, what do I do? Nothing. I don't think in the short term, Jao Pedro stops me. I don't think in the short term, Jao Pedro stops me. It's so distressful every year, like. You're all over the place. Of course. I'd just be so annoyed if he gets bent. Because Palmer's going to play, right? Palmer is going to play. Palmer will play. <laughs> He's looking at McGuire instead of Taylor. I'm not going to reveal the deadline because I'm tinkering. I just don't know. What I'm, I just don't know what I'm going to go with. 
He doesn't know what he's going to go with. He doesn't know what he's doing. Yeah, so there's rumours that Richardson could be dropped to the bench for Tottenham. Tonight. I actually got rid of him in the, the Real Viva the wild card for this game week. Is Maguire not put one million? Over Caleb, plus 0.3 million, probably not. Probably not. So disorganised? He's going to stick with Taylor instead of McGuire. Um, going to go back to X. I agree if there's any time to get Jao Pedro, it's now. But I mean, I still have 0 0.6 million in the bank. It's my team. predictions based. Not like super stats for money. Um, no, 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 Thanks for telling me. Because I have him. On my fantasy team. Oh, don't tell me he's not starting. Come on. Two minutes ago. Uh, well, I've got Gay though, so he also comes in very handy. I think. Come on. Maguire though, but the thing is, if Maguire does really well, I'm gonna be gutted that he doesn't have him. I don't have him. Uh, the FPL site hasn't crashed, as far as I know. Right now. It hasn't crashed. As far as I know. Come on. We're not gonna get the deals. And he's not going to tell us. Uh, my mates are in the group chat moaning that I'm. <laughs> mates I've known for like 20 years are moaning that I'm. I'm going to put a doggy on the bench. Get out, mate. Get out. Get out. I'm going to play Margaret Gibbs, right? I think I'm going to go out, Pedro. I, I'm on, right now I'm on 3 4 3. With 50 seconds to go. I'll tell you the thing with 50 seconds to go. I'm just. You can see it here. I'll just refresh it. I'll just get he's just going to refresh it. Oh, he's got Jared Bowen. This was the team that I oh, he's got Parmer. As well. Like right whoa, 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 whoa. That's not the right team. Oh, that's not the right team. Did you see what it is? That's what I'm on. Oh, he's putting Parmer on the bench. Oh, he's not going to start, is he? He's not going to start. I'm going to regret that straight away. I think the rest of the team is fine. I think Jao Pedro is my one risk. But I'm benching Palmer's on penalties as well. Yeah, in case yeah. If I thought yeah, time is up. Longer. Yeah, so um, so the deadline stream is um, now closed. No more. So my team is um, Ariola and Go. Playing three in defence now. 
Um, Cash, Trippier, Cornwell, Midfield, um, uh, Madison, Captain Salah, Saka, Palmer, and Morgan Gibbs Ray. And then um, my vice captain is um, um, Watkins, Haaland, Bench, Turner, Turner, Indoggy, Arthur, and Lamptey, who's not playing. So um, I want to say thank you for watching the stream. So I want to wish everybody the best look for hashtag game week 10. And I will see you in eight in eight days. So um, I'm going to love you to leave you guys. Thank you for watching for 100 ever minutes. Um, so I'm um, going to love you to leave you all true. Sam true. Stay clever. Thank you together. And have a great weekend. And stay safe as always. Thank you for watching TikTokers. Bye-bye.